Tonight I'm going to demonstrate how to get a lesson plan template from the Google Docs and then use it so and use it so that it's your own. So, I'm um, first thing I did is well, I'm going to go to Google. Here's Google. And I am going to go in and do a search for Google Drive templates. As you can see, I've searched it before. I go into Google Drive templates. Here's Google Docs templates. I click that. And I'm going to search. I found one already. I'm going to search Lesson Plan Basic. I do that, and it comes up with a lot of different, a wide variety of different basic lesson plans. I found one already that I thought was the best one, and it's the weekly OHS lesson plan. So I'm going to click that. reason why I like it is it's pretty simple and straightforward. What I'm going to do is once I have the lesson plan I like from this, I just, and when you search, if you want to just search weekly LHS lesson plans in that search box here, up here, right in here, it would come up right away. So if you would like to do that, type this in to that box and you'll just get this one to come up for you which would be easy to find, but when you find a template that you like, you want to click Use This Template, which I just did, and it'll say it's your copy of weekly LHS lesson plans. So now it's yours. You can edit it, you can do with it what you want. So because these aren't my subjects, I'm going to type in my subjects, religion, then I have math, language, reading, um, writing, science, history, spelling, and I'll put computer or something for computer time that we have. So I have all my subjects up there. And then for religion for Monday, I can type in, well, what I'm going to do first is I'm going to um, make this, I'm going to make a copy of this now. So I, do you see how I did that? Cancel. I'm going to, I went to file. Once I changed all this to the way, to the subjects that I actually teach, I go file make a copy. Enter a new document name. I'm going to name this um, Original Lesson Plans. And I click OK. So here's my Original Lesson Plans. And I've, I've named it. It's all good. I can edit this. So if I click out of this and I click out of this and I'm signed in to Google, you see my little picture. So that means I can go to my drive.google.com and in my drive I have my original lesson plans now. I also have the, the copy I can delete that, but I'm not going to go into that right now. So here's my original lesson plans. It's in my drive forever. So let's say it's, I don't know, whenever your lesson plan, Saturday, Sunday, it's whenever. You don't want to edit this lesson plan because you're going to change your original, right? So each week what I do is I go in and make a copy of my original lesson plan. I make a copy and I make this, well I can't because I already have a week one, but let's say I make it, I can make this week 12 lesson plans. And I say okay. And now, 
I have week 12 lesson plans. This then I can edit because in my drive, see here's week 12 lesson plans. Here's still my original. So watch what happens when I edit week 12. I'll put religion. Um, who is Martin? I don't know. Luther. And then math. It's Monday. We're going to be fractions and their issues. Okay. And so I, I can just lesson plan. And this will expand as I add more and whatever. So now I, I, I lesson plan for week 12. So if I go to my drive, I can show you. I will close both of these. My original lesson plans are the same. Okay, nothing's been changed to that. And my week 12 will have my changes in it. So each week I would go into my drive, open original lesson plans, make a copy and name it whatever week it, my lessons plans are for. And then I can edit that. So when I, so I have week 12 here. I made changes. Now when I'm done, when I'm done making all my lesson plans, what I can do then is I just click the share button and I put in the address of the person I want to send it to. And that's Carl Boberka. So I put his address in, I would click send, and it goes to him, and he has my lesson plans for that week. And so that's what I would do. So just to review, you go to Google, you go to Google, you would search for um, Google Drive templates. My internet's going slow. Oh no, it's not. I'm slow. There we go. And we put that in. You would go in, you would search Lesson Plan Basic, find the LHS one, down here, click it, click Use This Template, I already have it, and then it's yours to do with what you would like to do. I hope that helps.